us around some of your bikes, what you've brought this year, 2012 NABs. Absolutely. Um, well, I think we probably make sense to start over here. This would be a DeCurf Team SST. So Reynolds 853, cross country hardtail. You could say this, bikes of this genre would be what the company's history is built upon. We've been building bikes for 22 years. And this is kind of where it all started, although certainly a much more modern version than we were doing 20 years ago. Um, but incorporating the what I would call the traditional De Kerf monostay design, mm -hmm. pierced interlocking tubes. Um, that's really where it all started for us. And what is this beast here? I've never seen a paint job like this. Well, this is uh, the, well, the, the paint job is our the poker paint job. So incorporating all the elements of poker, the cards, the money, the chips. Uh -huh. Did you bring this to uh, to Vegas for Interbike? No, we didn't. This is a <laughs> this is a hand built show original. It's a hand built show. But this this frame is also a Team SST, but this is the fancy version. So full fillet braised um, internal cable routing 29er with a matching fork, and also a fillet braised uh, to curve bar stem combination. Unique design. Beautiful. This frame is also entered into the best Philip Ray's competition here at the show. So we'll see how it stands up against uh, all these great builders. <laughs> okay. What would, uh, how long would this frame take to build? Well, if we're talking about the whole thing as you see here, frame, fork, bar stem combination, you're probably in the 50 hour range. Okay. And if you were built that, uh, obviously built that spec for me, if I'm walking away with this, nothing else, what would that more or less go for? $5,000. Canadian dollars? Yeah, which is the same as US right now. They're trading it far. Oh, are they? Are? Okay. It's a beautiful, beautiful bike. Yeah. And what do we have here? Is this, uh, you, have you come back with the mountain bike here? Is this something... Uh, uh, I heard someone. Oh, I overheard someone say that you brought back the mountain bike. Uh, this mountain bike. Brought back. I'm not sure if I understand. All right. Uh, misunderstanding. Okay. Tell me about it. So this is uh, still on the mountain bike end of things, but uh, this is sort of the top end for us. So this is a full butted three two and a half titanium tube set, mm -hmm. custom painted as well. All these graphics and all this detailing is all paint. There's no decals on this bike whatsoever. This particular frame was also built with, with a weight conscious perspective, beyond the fact that it's obviously lightweight tubing, but extra features, special seat tube, ultralight, thin wall bottom bracket shell, machine head tube, the newest minimalist lightweight dropouts, frame weight 2.8 pounds, total, total weight for the bike is 19 pounds, that's with the suspension fork. Uh, full titanium or? Yes, full butted titanium tube set. Beautiful. Would you actually sell this uh, tomorrow after the show? This bike's already sold. It's already sold. I can see why. What, what did it go for? Uh, this bike was $8,000. I'll talk to my editor for the next one. Beautiful. Beautiful.